Okay, so a lot of people have asked us about the 3G capabilities of the Galaxy Tab 7.7 and the ability to use it as a phone, to connect to the internet when you're out and about and roaming and those sort of things. Now in Australia in particular, uh, the 7.7 .7 is Wi-Fi only. So you need to be able to either connect it to a Wi-Fi or a hotspot in order to be able to use it uh, and connect it to the internet. Now however, despite it only being Wi-Fi, it doesn't mean that it can't be used out and about. And one thing that some people may not be aware of is the ability of it to be able to be hotspotted and connected or tethered to a smartphone. And we're going to show you now how to connect it to a smartphone, uh, first using the Galaxy S2 and then using an iPhone because it can be done across both. Okay, so here we've got our Samsung Galaxy S2 and what we're going to do is tether it or make it a Wi-Fi hotspot so we can link it up to the 7.7 .7, which is only Wi-Fi. So what we need to do first is set this up as a Wi-Fi hotspot access point. So we're just going to settings here, wireless network, and tethering and portable hotspot. And we just manage the hotspots over here. Now we can now actually click into this to say that it is a hotspot. But instead of doing that, we're gonna go into here and we can see that this is all set up. There's our password, richio one so that's saved. Now we could click into here, but as you know, with Google um, and with uh, you know, Android, it's very flexible in terms of widgets and being able to customize your screens. So instead of having to do that each time, what we're going to do is show you how to actually create a widget for it, which means only one button access as a Wi-Fi hotspot. But what we can do now is actually set up a widget. So we go to the marketplace, we search for hotspot. And we can see that we've already done that. So this is the one that we've used here, the hotspot toggle, and that's already installed. So we'll just go into our uh, main manager here. We just simply press add, and we go to widgets. We move across and we find the widget we're looking for. Okay, so there's the hotspot toggle. So we just take that up and we choose where we want it to go. So we just put it on the front screen there. All right, so then there's some settings there. So that's fine. So all we now have to do is take the hotspot on. Then we go over to uh, the 7.7. .7. So now it says tethering hotspot active. We move across here, we go to settings. Okay, and we'll find in a second that Richie's Android has come up here. Let we'll just go into that. Use the password that we had, which was Richie01. R-I-T-C-H-I-E. O one. Oops. O one. Okay. Go to the browser. Here it comes. And we just type in website just here. Just go straight to it. And then you have it connected via a smartphone onto the 7.7 uh, 7 .7 from Samsung. So let's do the whole thing again but very uh, quickly on the iPhone as well.